Tennessee's final, spinal cord. So, spinal, um, cervical enlargement, lumbar enlargement. So there's the places that it's the widest. Conus medullaris. So it's this little triangular shape down here. The phylum terminale is the spinal nerve that comes off of the conus medullaris. See this one in the center. This whole width of nerve is the um, cauda equina. Brachial plexus, median nerve, and then on the arm you can see the axillary, muscular cutaneous, radial, and ulnar nerve. Cervical plexus, you have your cranial nerves coming off. Uh, cranial nerves come off and this forms your phrenic nerve. Remember the phrenic nerve innervates your diaphragm. This end we have our sacral plexus. The nerve you need to worry about is the femoral nerve. So femoral's right here. Sac um, sacral plexus is your sciatic nerve. So the femoral nerve comes up the lumbar. There's the, right. Okay. Right. the gang, what is it? The, the sympathetic chain ganglion mm -hmm. comes all the way down. Right. And on the spine placket here, you can see the dorsal rootlet, dorsal root, dorsal root ganglion. Where the nerves come together is mm -hmm. the spinal nerve, and then you have um, dorsal Rainy. rainy and ventral rainy. And then what so is this right here? Sympathetic, sympathetic chain, chain ganglion, ganglion and rainy communa concave. And you have your ventral rootlet yes. and ventral root. Um, and of course, the white matter, gray matter, um, this anterior, the medial anterior medial median fissure, superior median, I mean, a posterior median sulcus, your um, epidural space, space PMI matter, subdural space, yeah. subarachnoid space, dura matter, arachnoid matter, PMI matter. And that's a commissure, right? And that's a commissure, great commissure.